What's up, everybody? This is your boy Red, host of the IHD Show. Thank you so much for tuning into today's video. Listen, today is Inside Scoop with Red Fridays, and on uh, if you are new to the channel, which I know some of you are because I've been getting a few good subscribers uh, lately, uh, this is the day where I discuss the week's world entertainment news. That used to be the name of it, world entertainment news, but I changed it to Inside Scoop with Red because I'm giving my opinion and I'm giving y'all my thoughts on uh this week's world and entertainment news and first uh segment first news report i have and y'all probably noticed but i was reminded today again uh that the girls of the real if y'all know that last year um to marry tamara maori housley uh tamar braxton uh lonnie love i think that's her name um Jenny Mai and also Adrian Bailon, they, the five girls of The Real, they did a talk show, uh, sn a sneak peek into a, uh, uh, they did a demo type thing or whatever last summer, uh, and they have been picked up. So shout out to the girls, and they are all very, five opinionated girls, young girls, and um, they given the talk show scene a run for their money. So shout out to them, and hopefully one day I'll be a part of that group. Uh, not the real, but a part of the uh, talk show group. And, uh, uh, yeah, they, those girls are very, they say it like they mean it. Shout out to Wendy Williams for that slogan. But, uh, yeah, they say it like they mean it, and they give their opinion. And just like Wendy, speaking of Wendy, they... You know, those real girls, they say what we're thinking. And uh, and, and that show was pretty good. And I couldn't catch it here in North Carolina, but I did see some of it online. So, yeah, shout out to them. And, yeah, shout out to, uh, to what they're bringing to the table on come July, I believe July. So go to therealtalkshow.com and check out all things uh, The Real and check out uh, what when they're coming to your city and what time and the local listens and all of that for your city. Y'all, next report is about Bruce Dagon Jenner. Bruce Jenner. Uh, he uh, has just, uh, I just seen photos on uh, Inside, Inside Edition to where he was uh, coming out of a hospital, uh, a doctor's office or whatever. He had his his uh his Adam's apple or whatever shaved down y'all Dr. Phil said it looks like he is going through some kind of transformation and and uh allegedly Bruce's excuse was he never did like uh his 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 Adam's apple so yeah that's none of my business, but it's kind of crazy and the reason why I you know reported this I know some of y'all could care less about uh uh, uh, Kim Kardashian's stepdad, but it, it's kind of crazy what 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 people are doing nowadays, and and it. I just find it crazy. He just he 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 have no shame in his game. So, but let's go on with allegedly what he's doing, which is you know cutting it down because he didn't like it. And, and I don't know, opinion, my opinion is that he, you know, he is going through a change, you can tell by his hair and his, 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 the sculpture of his lip and like he had plastic surgery around there and, you know, allegedly or whatever, those are my opinions, so it is what it is. Next up, Justin Bieber. I've talked about this cat for a while and he's getting part of the, the misfits, the young naive, the young, stupid, not really stupid, but the young, crazy misfits of uh, the entertainment and the, and, the, and the world and the movie news or whatever, the industry or whatever. Um, he, I don't know, I don't know where his location is, if he out of jail or what, but he has been charged with, I don't know all his charges and I don't, and I'm not going through that, but now they're trying to get him deported back to Canada and his green card taken away and all of that and sign the petition. If y'all know what a petition is, please let me know. Let me know because I am uh, <laughs> wanting to sign it because I really don't like this dude. And he's becoming part of um, 
you know, the, the, like I said, the Misfit crew, and I talked about these Misfits of 2013 in my uh, top uh, most uh, fascinating people of 2013, my special, and you can check that link below if you missed it. I talked about Amanda Vines, and I talked about uh, Miley Cyrus, and I talked about, um, what's the other girl? Lindsay Lohan, but yeah, Justin is part of that group, y'all, and it's, it's very sad, and, and where is his mentor now? Where is his mentor now? This little boy need to get himself together, really, really, though. I'm, I haven't been a fan of Justin Bieber. He was a YouTube sensation. Come from, you know, my uh, my community here. So, but, uh, yeah. <sighs> lastly is, not lastly, but two more things. Uh, talking about the, the crazy storm, uh, the winter storm that just, just blew through the past few days. Uh, North Carolina here got a little bit of snow, and, and it's almost clearing up today. But shout out and prayers go out to those who... Um, uh, I don't know if I didn't hear any casualties, anybody lost lives, but uh, shout out to those and prayer go out to those who had wrecked their cars and, you know, those who have missed work and those who were stuck out in the cold during this time uh, in Atlanta. And, and it was crazy, you all. It was really crazy. So prayer go out to them and uh, us D.C. folks and the up north folks know how it is to travel and to, you know, basically maneuver through, you know, these snow uh, conditions. And and people here in North Carolina was just blown away by the snow and, and stores is closing and, and, and uh, the shelves is almost bare and all of that. So prayer goes out to uh, those that had dealt with it in in Atlanta or whatever. And, you know, adult really, you know, not really tragically, but... You know, had, had had you know had damaged vehicles and wrecked the cars and and was emotionally uh uh you know distressed through this this time. So prayer go out to them and prayer and shout out and to big ups to those who really stepped up and helped those and you know offer their home. And I you know seen this stuff, a few of them on Inside Edition and some people was reporting it on Instagram to where I seen that people opened up their doors to them. So you know. Double time blessing back to you all who lended a helping hand. And lastly, the Super Bowl. Who are y'all going for the Super Bowl? None of my uh, my team did not make it. Uh, we didn't even make it really half through the season. Y'all know who my team is, the Washington Redskins. But um, Washington Redskins. But yeah, uh, I'm going for the Seattle Seahawks. Let me know who are you who are you going for. And uh, I'm going to be popping in on Sunday during the Super Bowl. And I'm going to a little gathering or whatever. And, you know, let me know what y'all are doing uh, uh, for the Super Bowl. Now, like I said, on that video, just comment uh, below and let me know what y'all are uh, doing. And who y'all rooting for. And, you know, if y'all place bets or whatever. But anyway, yeah, let me know Sunday who y'all going for. It's between the different Broncos and the Seattle Seahawks. But that is it, y'all. That's the... the uh, today's edition of Inside Scoop with Red here on the RH3 show. Know that I love you for real and continue to follow me on uh, Twitter, twitter.com forward slash the RH3 show. Friend me on Facebook and let's discuss all of this. And next Thursday, I'm going to put another uh, posting up to let me know what y'all want me to talk about on the next week's Inside Scoop with Red. And uh, uh, you can come in and talk to me on there throughout the week. And you don't have to wait to YouTube to talk to me. Know that I love you for real and I'll see you next time here on RH3. Peace. I know they wasn't expecting this one, man. <laughs> Let's get it going. I like me. Yo, you like me. Cause I like me. I just had to do, do a like remix me? to this, yo. See, I, like me. I mean, the Cause beat is just me. so crazy. God likes me. Yo, you don't <laughs> like me. Like it's your boy yo, you putting like in me? work for the same bill. Like me. Do you like me? Here's a little See, testimony like how I came like to me. like me. <laughs> Here we go. Yo, Listen. Like yo, yo, it's JP, that big ear, big eye dude. That fool, that stooge, that new guy dude. Who tried hard to be accepted and to be high cool, but spent most of his life in the D-Night pool. That dude who was viewed as a no-like.